is Anime Loves YouTube channel. How you all doing? Thank you for tuning in everybody whether you are new or whether you are a subscriber. If you're not a subscriber and you like what you see, press the subscribe button. If you're not sure, watch some of my other videos and make a decision then. Today's video I'm going to be doing is a hair product video. Now the products in question is Cream of Nature Pure Honey Moisturizing Dry Defense product. This one right here this is the conditioner this is the shampoo it has pure honey rich coconut oil creamy shea butter no sulfate or mineral oil um i wish it didn't have coconut in it but i just gonna see what it is like and hopefully my hair will love it they did have a mask but because i was buying other things again when i got to the teal it was just like i did not come into superdrug to spend that much money these come in 12 fluid ounces 355 milliliters okay uh, so I'm gonna do my hair. I'm gonna do my hair like I usually do. Start off dry, and I love the bottle. Mm, it's got a really nice smell to it. This is what it looks like. Okay. Oh, whoa! Really good slip on it. Oh, 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 it covers my hair really quickly. You know, you just don't expect it. Like some shampoos do that. You put it in your hair and it's just like your hair just takes to it straight away. These retail about six pounds each, they do. Now when you do your hair this way, I've seen this in my many, many other videos, it does use a lot of shampoo because, you know, you're not looking to foam it. But I find this technique really good for detangling. I just give my hair a good massage in the scalp. So I don't show um, how I wash my hair, so I'm just going to talk you through it. So after I do my hair, I will then go get the shower hose and then I will rinse my hair, not rinse it, I will wet my hair, put quite a lot of water in it and then I will then lava it up. Sometimes it lavas, sometimes it don't. It just depends how much shampoo I put beforehand and obviously how dirty my hair is. So I've come back obviously and I've rinsed up my hair. My hair feels lovely and you know it always does. It just feels so nice. It feels, it doesn't feel stripped at all. Um, it feels, it does feel moisturized. I have had products that feel a lot more moisturizing. It doesn't feel stripped. Now it's time for the conditioner. This is so nice to wash with, I'm not gonna lie. It just, I don't know, it's just like washing with soft cloth. Like, it was just so lovely to wash with. Oh man, gorgeous, gorgeous feeling. This is the conditioner. It's a lovely baby color, and it doesn't wanna come out for me. I'll say, here we go. Thick, 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 thick. And that's us curly girls like to a nice big color. Can you see me? Hop on in the oh, 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 oh. <laughs> You know, you just always keep getting shocked, like it's a lot more smoother. It has a nice fragrant smell to it, but it's quite mild. My hair is just sapped that up. It goes to show how much moisture my hair is needing. Just gonna use oh, this feels quite nice. It does feel really nice. Because it's so thick. You know, I love the thickness of it. My hair loves thick products. That's why castor oil is one of my favorite products to use. Ooh. And now it's time to stick my cap on and then rinse. Okay, I am back. My hair has been washed and rinsed. My hair feels a little bit, um, it's, uh, I find that it was, you know, like some, my previous, reviews I've done on some other products that the shampoo and the conditioner, not necessarily the same ones, um, they feel better when you're using them and once you've rinsed it out, it's kind of like, oh, okay, and that's what this feels like, like when I was using it, it felt amazing, my hair felt really, really nice, and even when I was putting it in, but now it's rinsed out, it just feels a bit, okay, it's not too bad, you know, it's just, it feels full. My roots feel quite soft. It does feel really nice and soft. But the ends of my hair, it just feels a little bit, not totally crispy, but it's just like, um, it's not bad. Don't get me wrong, it's not bad. But my hair just feels okay. You know what? I think I really need to take a serious, serious break because I just, <laughs> do you know what it is? You know when you do and are about something. So I did buy the mask. So this is 
what the mask looks like. It comes in a big tub like this. And it's really soft. It's very, very thick. And this feels really, really nice on the hair. And you see the curls. It's a generous amount. That's why you need these big tubs. Like with the conditioner, I love how it feels when the product is in your hair. It feels so nice. Your hair just feels bouncy and lovely and soft. Hi, I'm back and I have really stacked the mask. It was sitting in my head for quite a while because I was just busy doing bits and pieces. Um, yeah, my hair feels really nice. It feels soft. I do like the mask. The mask my hair feels really, um, you can, in the roots, you can, it, just, it feels really hydrated where the product and the water, my hair is like really, really curly in the roots. You can really, really feel it. It looks really, really thick. Um, but yes, I, I like it. I would use the range again. It's not something I wouldn't use. I do like it. And um, my hair doesn't feel stripped. It doesn't feel um, dry or anything like that. I think I prefer it to the conditioner, but just slightly. It does feel really nice soft and hydrated so yeah so guys i would definitely buy this again if you've tried this these um products please let me know in the comment box box down below and let me know how your hair took to it and what type of hair you have like type a c t d d d four five whatever you know what i'm talking about anyway guys if you like this video you know exactly what to do and until next time i shall see you later